salty bay. It's what they do. Hey, Walking Dead fans, we're going to go over a couple of promos that AMC have released on the upcoming episode. And yes, beta has arrived. But the first one we're going to go over is a small clip called You Had to Lie. It's a sneak peek at a scene, and it's during while the Whispers, Alpha and her group, walking back from the hilltop, I guess, to their camp. You had to lie. So did they. It's what they do. Alpha's talking to Lydia, saying, you know, why you can trust animals is because animals don't lie. But you had to lie, talking to Lydia, you had to lie to them, but they lied to you because that's just what they do. But Alpha definitely seems protective. She ends up giving her an apple. It's uh, petting her on the head kind of thing after that. You know, kind of like you would do a treat to a dog or something. So it's it's a weird kind of protection. It's a weird kind of thing that that's her mother-daughter relationship kind of thing. Why, you know, Lydia said she's not going to come and get me and why she actually did come and get her. That relationship of saving her daughter is a superiority thing. I'm not sure actually how that plays into the whole psycho thing of what she's saying. And I don't know how much it'll be spelled out to us other than just showing us stuff like this. But of course I can't play this or the other one out in its entirety. And links for both will be in the description below. I acted like I needed help. We need to protect ourselves. We need to be ready. Okay, this next episode, episode 12 of season 9 of The Walking Dead, coming up is called The Guardians. And as this trailer promo piece called Guardians opens up, we see the scene from the scene that we just left and talked about of Alpha and Lydia and the rest of the Whisperer group walking back to their camp from Hilltop. We get a cool above shot of them walking through the field, and then we get a shot like this where they're set, and I don't know if this is just a resting point right here or if this is actually part of their camp. But then, of course, we see Henry. Henry, I guess, following, tracking Lydia and the group. And he does take one whisperer down that tries to attack him, but then Beta steps in. You see the boot, and then Beta just kind of picks him up pretty much and takes him back to what looks like the whisperer camp. We do see Alpha there. Lydia's in the background. There's a lot of quick shots and quick cuts and stuff, but it pretty much leads up to Lydia punches Henry in the face. She's got to make some kind of showing of, you know, I can't show that I'm for this guy or show weakness. I've got to show strength in this moment, even though it's going to hurt Henry, and I don't know how this is all going to play out. But I think eventually as we get to a shot here in just a second, I have a theory on how it could play out. We need to protect ourselves. We need to be ready. But we do hear Beta speak um, for the first time. I think there may be another promo out there somewhere. I'm going to look around and see what else has been released. And we may hear him talking other than this, but this is the first time I heard him talk and first time we saw him really up close. I think it's pretty awesome. I think it's really cool. And how the dynamics are between them and just his character, it's just going to be really amazing to see uh, the next episode. It's going to be a whole lot of Beta. But it does seem like Connie is kind of a tracker herself because she goes out with Daryl, you know, like uh, if you saw the last video, I uh, did the review of the episode and right at the end of the episode, Daryl was going out to look for Henry and Connie goes with him. Connie seems to realize as well as Daryl, I'm sure, with a dog helping him that Henry did catch up with the Whisperer group and they took him. But kind of surprisingly, we do get Alexandria in the next episode. We see Michonne talking to Father Gabriel, and she says, reaching out is dangerous. So I think this scene, this little clip with Michonne and Gabriel, because he comes back at her and says, but what? who are we going to reach out to when we're in need? And I think this clip is talking about that water tower scene where Eugene goes out and puts on the radio amplifier to amplify the signal so that they can talk to further groups outside from themselves farther away i think that might introduce them to new dangers just as michonne is kind of saying in this clip and of course when eugene went out to the water tower in rosita that was crossing into the land because they went out kind of further than they were supposed to that was crossing into the territory of the whispers that's what kind of got it all started. So Michonne has a right, I think, to be upset. I'm, I'm interested in seeing what Father Gabriel's angle is to this and how Michonne reacts to it. Because it is a tension in this apocalyptic world. You know, if you watched Fear the Walking Dead, I think it was season two, 
Alicia reached out on the radio. They were on a boat, and she made friends with a guy, and the guy coerced her into thinking he, he was in trouble and he needed help. And when they came on board, of course, they had guns and tried to take over the ship. That was like a little ploy they had. So you do have to watch about reaching out in this pirate-type world that's kind of going on right now. But we did see this little quick clip before in some promos, and I couldn't tell before as far as quality and stuff who this might be. I knew it was some uh, whisper, uh, a walker or a whisper, someone in a mask, and I do think now that I see it, it is a whisper in a mask, and Beta's kind of throwing him down for some reason. I'm not sure, but hopefully we'll see next episode. And now to this frame. Check this out. This is very interesting. Um, as far as them setting in the woods earlier, don't think that was the count, but definitely this is the count. You can see the sticks there. Clearly, it has mask hanging on there. I didn't know if it was heads or not at first, but you can clearly see, I think, especially the lower one there, that's just a mask hanging there. And you see Beta, it looks like he's possibly preparing a mask or something over there. But Henry's definitely tied up to a tree. He's prisoner. And we get this shot again. We've seen it in a promo. And I think it's just a, could be a spoiler alert. I don't know. It's just a theory. But I think that's possibly another whisper. And might have had something to do with the baby now that I saw that uh, play out. And she's reprimanding or somebody is they're reprimanding somebody i think in this scene and that's what's happening to this guy and he's actually a whisperer that might be actually the guy that beta had up against the tree but a very pivotal shot too we see that looks like a smaller um shorter stake looks like the one we saw before as far as sticks with mask on there and then we see two behind that and i'm sure it's probably this same shot right here just at night and framed differently so we could see the other two stakes or sticks in the background with mask hanging on them but it's definitely really awesome and it gives you the impression of what is coming if you uh, know or have heard about the pike scene coming with some people dying and they put their heads on pikes that's what it may look like right there except it's not going to be mask it's going to be the actual uh, zombified walker head you know of a survivor that they kill but this scene, this night scene that we're seeing here, they're bringing Henry out. They have Lydia standing there. An Alpha throws a knife down on the ground. And pretty much it's like, okay, you guys, let's see who wins. See who's the toughest. Or she pretty much says, Lydia, you know, Beta may hold him the whole time. She may be saying, Lydia, go make you a new mask. You know, go cut this dude's head off. Once he turns into a walker, you know, and everything, you can skin it. And make you a new mask or something like that. That's what I, I'm predicting that she may say something like that. But definitely kill Henry or fight to the death. It's one of those things. But I do think it's in that moment somewhere in there. Either Lydia grabs the knife and her and Henry take off running. Or Daryl and Connie show up. The dog possibly could alert them or something. And they say, you know, oh shit, somebody's here. And they have to like not worry about the fight all of a sudden because we do see this scene of them hurrying up looking like they're all putting their mask on so i'm thinking daryl arrives the dog something spooks them or lydia and henry take off running and they put their mask on to go take off after them but that's pretty much for these promos these clips these two right here i'm going to look for some more there'll be some more videos coming Definitely look for the Season 9 Episode 11 review video. Check it out. It reviews the entire episode. And another video about the symbol we saw on the road sign, the back of the road sign, the kingdom at that uh, theater in that episode. You can join in on that discussion in the comments of that video. But definitely, as always, thanks for watching. And don't forget to subscribe for more dead stuff. Mm -hmm.